Why, hello there. Gregory Best from Saskatchewan War Memorials. Here to explain more detail than the projects that we're currently working on. Uh, we are still trying to record every cenotaph and war memorial here in Saskatchewan. But as the winter months uh, come upon us very quickly and rising gas prices, that uh, we're going to probably have to take a break from our travels this year. But we're going to focus on a project that's closer to home and a new idea that I was thinking of and was almost made famous by YouTube and the fans themselves. Um, we started doing shorts on gravestones and maybe just because Remembrance Day is almost upon us that uh, it's gaining a little bit of traction. So what I decided to do is I want to make a short out of every gravestone in the Regina Cemetery, the one that was established in around 1880. And I think in the grand sense of our new virtual world that we live in, that it almost brings the spirit of some of these people back to life again. And the fact that if you're scrolling your Facebook, or YouTube and you see your last name or maybe even a relative uh, that would probably inspire some emotion of some kind uh, hopefully positive and and then maybe even encourage me to go forward with this my first idea is that I want to do a short on every person here in this military grave site uh, it's gonna be a little tricky uh, but I think it will be enjoyable, really, and just to uh, show everyone the project idea. And like I said, I mean, the very least a person could do is to bring these guys back to life in some sort of fashion, not just remembering the battles or the conflicts of the world at the time, Perhaps more now the individual, the individual sacrifice that a lot of these guys had to make. And, you know, it just breaks my heart when you see like 20 year olds, 18 year olds listed here and, and, you know, people didn't get to live their lives at all. So for those people that not only gave the ultimate sacrifice of their lives, they gave their use as well, which is heartbreaking. So I hope you join me and support us in this project and i think that i mean it could only bring good karma to the world on this situation and you know like i said if i show someone's relative and they see them or even your last name just to give you a sense of mortality in life and seeing someone with your similar last name that has passed a long time ago but uh I hope you guys can all understand slightly what I'm trying to accomplish here. And like I said, at the bare minimum, if veterans get to see these or family members or anyone interested in history, that's how I started doing this stuff. Um, as a person born in 1987, you would think that it would not have this much passion when it comes to history but i do because strongly believe that if you forget what happened in the past you are doomed to make similar mistakes and if you review history enough perhaps you could avoid similar mistakes other people have made in your own lives or pass the wisdom down to others in your life but everyone that's uh basically the sum of it i hope you all have a great evening and i hope you all have a great thanksgiving and have a good night